Hey there, South Jersey. I'm meteorologist Joe Martucci. Loads of sunshine here in Ocean City. The sun gently casting itself along the boardwalk here. And we will see plenty of more sunrises like this as we go on throughout the week. Here are our low temperatures. We're in the 30s for most of the mainland here. But along the shore, we are in the mid 40s, even a 50 spot in Lower Township, just around Villas over there. 49 degrees in Forest View, 37 in Millville, and that is a 12 degree difference in just 10 miles. So you drop a degree a mile here in parts of the area early this morning. For today, we're talking about temperatures around 60 degrees on the mainland, 58 over at the Jersey Shore. We have that gusty northwest wind up to 25 miles an hour at times, but other than that, we are looking okay. Then for tonight, we will have another big difference in temperatures and spots, upper 30s in the Pine Barrens. Once you start getting to the Cape May County shore, should be in the low 50s, all because we have a clear sky and calmer winds. Notice those winds, only 48 miles an hour, and that promotes something called radiational cooling on the mainland where the heat from the day can escape straight into outer space. So we have that for tonight. Then as we go into Halloween, it could be our warmest in 10 years, definitely be our warmest since 2013. And with the high of 68 on the mainland, yes, it will be our warmest Halloween since 2009. Lots of spooky sunshine, but it looks to be all treats here for our holiday. And as we go forward into our afternoon and into the evening, everybody wants to know what is the weather going to be like for trick-or-treating? Well, very comfortable outside here for late October in South Jersey. Temperatures slide throughout the 60s for much of the afternoon. Then we'll be in the 50s as we go into the evening. As we look at our mainland seven-day forecast, you can leave the windows open on Wednesday night. Great sleeping weather temperatures in the mid-50s. And then we have Strong southwesterly winds on Thursday. Temperatures in the mid-70s on the mainland. That is about 15 degrees above average. But this is all ahead of a cold front that will be raining. Even a couple of rumbles of thunder Friday may linger into early Saturday. We're going to be optimistically dry for now. Say it is going to be dry with plenty of sunshine. And then our next shot of rain will be in the early part of next week. Short seven-day forecast. Not as warm as the mainland on Thursday, but still 70 degrees. Very nice if you want to take the boat out. Great early November boating weather. And then Friday again, showers, maybe a rumble of thunder. Overall, though, looking like a nice weekend for the shore here in late October. That's all for what we have for now. We'll be back with you later today with a new forecast. We'll talk to you about our on the road real quick, though. We'll be in Linwood and Northfield at 8.45 a.m. at Northfield Community School. And then we will be over at Fisher Woods and Linwood. And this is all part of our on the road initiative to go to all 63 towns. That we cover here at the Press of Atlantic City. Wanna know makes your town of South Jersey special? And you can follow along using the hashtag Martucci's Map. And you can use that hashtag on Facebook and Instagram at JoeMarkWX, Twitter at ACPressMartucci, or thepressofac.com slash weather.